My name is Noah Eccleston. I'm the cool-looking one who's ready to pounce. This is a story about me and my twin brother, Peter. Leapfrog, Noah! Yeehaw! Follow them. Careful. The twins will hear us. To your right, bro. Go get them. When we aren't competing with each other, Peter and I make a great team. Noah, you're supposed to say target spotted 10 o'clock, 45 degrees elevation. We may be identical twins, but Peter and I are anything but the same. Whatever, Peter. Ah, oh, not again. Spotter, reverse, cover me. You got it. I've got your back, bro. And while I watched Peter's back, Noah, check your six. Peter watched mine. Uh-oh. Here's an interesting fact for you. Ah! If you scream like a lunatic, yay, 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 yay! What the? It makes it pretty hard for opponents to shoot straight. Make that two screaming lunatics. Ah! And you're done for. We didn't hit either of them? The stinks, they always win. There's a reason for that. They know the value of teamwork. Whoa, it's Coach Patterson. You're a living legend, a three-time paintball state champion. Something like that. I hear you boys play here every weekend. You must really love the sport. We sure do, sir. I'm putting together a team of young, talented players. Are either of you interested? We sure are. Great. There's just one catch. The next day at school, how can there be only one open spot on the team? Nine of ten spots on the squad have already been filled. Yeah, I just wish we both could make the team. Agreed, but are you ready to compete for the spot? There's one thing Coach Patterson doesn't know. Brother, I was born ready. Outside of paintball, we compete in everything. English class? Once again, Peter scored the highest. Play tryouts? I think we've found our Romeo. Sports? Even volunteer work. That was fast. Thanks, Sonny. Like I said, we compete over everything. So why do we compete? <laughs> Later, in Dad's office. Boys, Coach Patterson called me today. I take it there's something you haven't been telling me. All our lives, Dad has taught us that winning is what's most important. The real world can be a cruel and unforgiving place. In the real world, you can only count on yourself. If you want to impress me, you'll need to compete with each other. I thought this paintball business was just fun and games, but now I see the potential. Patterson's team will compete in the televised paintball championship. It's a great opportunity, and at your tryout tomorrow, one of you will make me proud. On the day of the tryout, and one of you will make me proud. Peter, are you okay with this? It's what Dad wants. Do you believe all that stuff, that you can't count on anyone? Dad was a soldier, and now he's a successful businessman. He would know. But it's okay if you're just scared that you can't beat me. Bring it, bro. Welcome, boys. Meet Sam and Cora otherwise known as King and Queen. They're my team captains, and they'll be leading your competition. There are no flags to capture today. You'll need to prove how much you want to be a part of this team. The rules are simple. Peter, Noah, if one of you marks the other, then the game's over. But it probably won't be that easy. My nine players will be hunting both of you every step of the way. You'll earn a point for each opponent that you mark. 
If either of you are marked, then whichever one of you has the most points will win. Huh! One point for me. He took the bait. He's trapped. Uh-oh. This is a lot harder without Peter covering me. Follow him and stay in formation. Hmm, broken branches. He's around here somewhere. These guys are good. If I break cover and start firing, he'll mark me. I'm trapped. I wonder how Peter's doing. Meanwhile, this is almost too easy. I wonder how Noah's doing. I swear I just heard something. I'm blind! How did he... He heard us coming. You had the drop on me, but you were impatient. I heard the leaves rustling. Well, you got us, smart guy, but what about them? Whoa! I better find some cover! Meanwhile, time to make my move. Oh! There he is! Get him! Paintball had always been a time when Peter and I could work together as a team. It just wasn't the same without him by my side. But maybe Dad is right. Maybe winning is what's most important. Meanwhile... Those cameras and the masks of all your players let us see exactly what they see. This is amazing. Your boys are amazing, Mr. Patterson. I'm just sorry they have to compete against each other like this. I'm not. How else will we know which one is better? Wouldn't you prefer to see them work together? As a team, they'd be stronger than if they worked alone. Ha! I'll believe it when I see it. Maybe you will. I was in a tough spot. Come on out! We've got you cornered! Hmm. Peter! Flank them to the right! What? Are they working together? Where'd he go? Peter wasn't really there. But they didn't know that. Once again, I wondered where Peter really was. You rang, Noah? Peter? You missed me, Pete. How many have you tagged so far? Four? Same here. Then that just leaves King. Whichever one of us marks him wins. Or I can mark you. That'd make me the winner. In your dreams, Noah. This is great. I can't wait to see which one of my boys will win. Just then, we spotted King. We didn't plan what happened next. We just did what came naturally. We worked together. Ah! I'm marked. Well, what are you two waiting for? Finish it. I'd call that a tie. Huh? Sounds good to me. Boys, what are you waiting for? Finish it! There's no tying in paintball. Yeah, there has to be a winner. I know I should try to win, but I just don't want to mark my brother. I was tempted, but I hear you, bro. I just couldn't pull the trigger. It's not worth it. Not worth it? We're talking about winning. Winning is always worth it, no matter what the cost. Maybe for you, Dad. But when we work together, when we're covering each other's backs... There's nothing quite like it. That's the part that feels like winning. Yeah, Peter can be a real pain, but nothing makes me happier than covering his back and knowing that Peter has mine. I see. You boys are right. We are? I guess I got a little carried away, but you guys learned the right lesson anyway. I'm proud of you. Both of you. Sorry, Coach. I guess you'll have to find a different player. I suppose so. But if I ever have two spots open on my team, 
you know I'll be calling. Of course, if I'd been trying, I would have beaten you, Noah. Yeah, right. You're just lucky I didn't want to mark you. Some things never change. <laughs>